Yeah. They assume we are the same height. <laughs> you want to be done having kids by 30. Y'all want to get pregnant in 2023. He doesn't love to be on Instagram anymore. Um, do we regret moving to Arizona? What is up you guys? Welcome back to our channel. She pulled my ear into this video. <laughs> no, I did not. And people actually do think that. Today we're doing an assumption video. <laughs> For real? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we're doing an assumption video, so we're gonna answer your assumptions. We haven't done this video in a while, but I've been noticing we have gotten so many assumptions recently. I'm like, we just gotta smash everything. People forgot who we are. I know. Just take a minute. You done? Come on. Dallin hasn't seen any of them, so are you ready for this? It's she all asked them. me if I wanted to pick some, and I said, "Surprise me." I think it's funnier that way. Let's do it. Let's start off. Let's start off with the, this one. Dallin is a neat freak. <laughs> like, like a clean freak? Absolutely. Oh, one billion Absolutely. percent. He has a specific order for every little thing that he has, and if it's not in its specific place, like. You are so specific. There's nothing wrong with that. No, and I need to be better at that. Yeah, the opposite of that is a walking tornado as her family calls her. <laughs> she, she is, <laughs> if that didn't give that away. I would rather be clean, but whatever. She was your I do do a lot of cleaning when, when I get in that mode. She Yeah, like every month. <laughs> She's <laughs> yeah. a very good cleaner. Like When I do clean. When she does clean. I will say that. I'm like, wow, where did this come from? <laughs> but leading up to that, I'm like, you make your life so much harder by <laughs> making a mess and then just having to spend all day cleaning. True. Instead of just like, I, I just never understood the concept of like someone does dishes. Like if everyone just did their dish, then no one would have to do dishes. <laughs> <laughs> Besides of course, like the dishes you clean or cook with. But. Yeah, yeah. Someone said, they assume we are the same height. <laughs> let's, let's stand up real quick and show this. Here's Paula. I think I am by like, Literally probably like half an inch last time I think we checked. Oh, Odin's gonna oh, measure too. You're taller? <laughs> I think it's like, I think it's me about Hardly half an inch. Anyway. But also I think it's like a slant there, so. <laughs> you want to ha be done having kids by 30. Me or like us? What do you mean you? You can't just have a child on your own. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I said that. So you want me to have a child at 30? I feel like this is a trick question. Is that bad? 30 years old? My mom had Jaden at like 36. Dude, your mom's like 40. 30. Hope she's not watching this. My dad had me when he was 24. My mom was 34. Anyway, <laughs> I yeah, I think I have to be done having kids by 30. What? That's not that old. No, it's not. But I agree that's not old. But I want my body. You made to it be sound like I was like putting you like to war. <laughs> no. You want me to have a kid? Dirty? No. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> what? No. That's why I, I said I thought this was a trick it. question. Like, what did I say wrong? No. I want. I want to like. My body is young and able to like bounce back so much quicker in my twenties than it would be in my thirties. So that's what I'm saying. I want to be done before my thirties. Every year and a half to two years, if my body can handle it, and if I can even have kids. Time will tell you guys, time will tell. This one I also laughed at too, because of a few reasons. Dallin gets sick of eating at Texas Roadhouse. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite place. But since moving to Arizona, there are so many good restaurants. In Utah, we literally, excuse me. In Utah, there was like only chains. So we I only love Texas ate at Texas Roadhouse, Roadhouse. But I do like some other restaurants too. Yeah, but since moving here, he's like, Alyssa, because originally we were going to move very quickly after. It's like, we only have this much time being here. Why don't we try all the fun places? I'm like, ah, oh, good point. So that's why we haven't been to Texas right now because we want to try all the Arizona places before we move. But we'll save that for another time on if we are staying or moving. Tune in. You're freaking huge. Wow. Wow. Y'all want to get pregnant in Hold 20... Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, my lips are so chapped. Y'all want to get pregnant in 2023. Nope. Mm, mm. If it was God's plan, yes. We get pregnant in 2023? Yeah. Maybe. Next, Dallin cooks and I clean. Yep. Chef Boy RD. <laughs> That's how it should be, honestly. Dallin's a really good cook. But I cook and he cleans. Someone asked, so this kind of goes with what you said at the beginning of the video. He doesn't love to be on Instagram anymore. I love Instagram. 
I really do. He's still a fan. I wonder why they think that. I don't know, maybe because you don't post on yours as much. I actually have noticed I don't he post as many like talking videos anymore. Have you noticed I've done that the last couple days? Yeah. Because I'm like, what the heck happened? He does a lot of like back end stuff for like all of our social media stuff. He has a lot that you guys don't realize. So that's, he's been consumed by a lot of that too. Plus I'm still in school. So I think I've just gotten like- Consumed with so much. Consumed with so much that I like, cause I was always like talking on stories. Especially when we like first got married and stuff. Like you were in school the first part of our marriage. Mm -hmm. So we were, yeah. I was always on active, but also we had Caitlin always taking pictures for us for content. There's so much. So it's do. harder to like get content, especially if we want content together. And Caitlin, if you're watching this, we love you. We love you dearly. No, I do love, I do love Instagram and social media. I just need to kick back into gear. I've been mm -hmm. so, also Indie Clover is a big one. Oh my gosh. That has been a huge one in our life. That's kind of. Switch us up she, a bit. she kind of took over posting on that project because I was like, I was basically the contractor. We didn't have a contractor, so I did all of that. Plus, we were moving to a new state, so it was it was a lot. lot. A lot of people were like, "You miss him? Like, he hasn't been on social media as much." Oh, what? You guys? You're making his day. Yeah, make my heart warm. Next one, you got married fast because you felt pressured because I didn't have a ring by spring. We didn't feel pressured. I feel like that was a poem. It kind of was, huh? We didn't feel pressured at all to get married by anyone. We were young, yes, but we were ready. Yes. Well, also that's like you, you're, you're never, never ready, ready, but but we get to grow up together now, right? Yeah, we get to grow up together. This question gets me. What? Odin loves Dallin more. Yeah, buddy. High five. High five. You completely. Yeah. They are best of friends. When Odin wants to sleep and cuddle, he will lay by me. When he, he wants to play. He's he just farted in my farted? face. Right there. Good boy. Yeah. Good fart. High five. Yeah, dude. Odin loves Dallin a lot more. I mean, he loves both of us, but like he loves Dallin. Um, do we regret moving to Arizona? Not at all. No, it's been so fun. Not even a little bit do I regret it. No, we don't regret moving to Arizona. We actually love it a lot. Yeah, I don't, regret, I don't regret it at all. I think, so when we have kids in the future and are married, would you say, yeah, Absolutely. we're about to stay? Because I think it's very good us just being on our own, not family here. Yep. We've, you don't go to church very often. Love y'all. I don't know what gave you that message. We go every Sunday. It's our. We don't post about it, but we go every Sunday. It's and we don't post about it because we don't go to church. We post about it because our apartment just has terrible lighting <laughs> to know. like take like a Sunday picture. We because we use. They probably think this because we used to take a Sunday picture all the time. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. And we don't take Sunday pictures ever. So, but yeah, we go to church every Sunday. It's like one of our things. We love. We love going to church. Seeing that's really where we like meet people too is because we don't go anywhere else throughout the week to like meet people because we work from home mm -hmm. other than indie clover so like that's really where we like we have friends there and it's so fun so we get to hang out with people when we go to church yeah. so that's like our highlight of our week to be honest one of them yeah one of them. that was the last question that's it mm -hmm. this is a good good catch y'all got a lot of assumptions but i love them that's good oh there was another one we said we were going to move back to utah after this lease was up and people are assuming that we were lying because they are like, you just started, you just opened a business. How could you leave? Like, there's no way you could possibly do that. So that is a good thought. We were not lying at all, at all. We have hired out at an Indie Clover. So we have employees and they just kind of run the, run the show. We do the behind the scenes stuff, Yeah. but from home, we don't have to be there. But we go in like at least once or twice a week. We went in a lot more at the beginning, but yeah, yeah. now it's like once or twice a week. Yeah. Check on Our those. employees are incredible. We just love them. Yeah. So we could go back to Utah if we wanted, but yeah. for right now, we're actually looking at a place. <laughs> for right now, we're actually looking to stay here. So at least for another six months to a year. Mm -hmm. And we're excited about that. We're very excited. You, you ready to move? Online. You ready to move? He wants it's coming a, up quick. He wants a backyard. We literally have this last month and then the next month is movie month. Wow. We got it. Here we go. Thank you guys so much for watching. We love you all. And so much. And appreciate each and every one of you. So thanks if for If I could give around. you all a little hug, I would. I know. It's true. Love you guys. Later. Bye.